Hi, this is Maxi. This tutorial will demonstrate how to remove the protection of Vitrium PDFs so they can be viewed on mobile devices. The things used in this tutorial are Windows 7 PC, PDF reader like Adobe, Vitrium protected PDF with username and password, virtual PDF printer like PDF Creator and Google products must have an account with Google Chrome browser and Google Drive the links to download Adobe PDF Reader and PDF Creator will be in the description in order for us to open a Vitrum protected PDF we must have a login information like the username and password go ahead and enter your username and password to unlock the document we have now unlocked the PDF document just an FYI if you want to check if a PDF is protected go to file properties and under security tab you will see the security methods used. If we were to print this document to another PDF document, it will not work and will result in error because of the security settings implemented on the PDF document. So we must use another method. We are now going to save this PDF document into an XPS document. We can do that by going to File print under the printer select Microsoft XPS document writer click print select the folder where you want to save the document I'm going to save mine in the pictures folder I'm gonna name it psych chapter 1 I'm gonna click save and replace the one that I have already saved earlier. Our PDF document is now an XPS document. We are now going to open our XPS document and convert it into a PDF document. We are now going to convert this XPS document by simply clicking the print button and selecting PDF Creator as the printer and then click print we are now prompted to name our document click save and click save again we have now converted our XPS document into a PDF document. Another method to convert your XPS document is to upload it to Google Drive. You must have a Google account in order for you to do this. And I'm gonna open up my Google Drive here. I've already uploaded my XPS document. Then I'm gonna open it. and I'm going to print this document and save it as a PDF just click save name your document We have now just converted our XPS document into a PDF document. We are now going to open the document and check the security settings. Go to File, Properties, and under Security tab, you will see that there is no security methods used. 